You think you know me. Hello everyone, welcome back to Final Fantasy X HD. In the last episode, we talked to Yuna and now we know how to battle with every single character. Not really. And today, I am guess I'm taking... we are going to take the boat from somewhere to somewhere. Oh, yeah, we said to somewhere. Can we talk to you? No, we can't. I guess we could just walk with them. Oh, so the woman is kind of stiff here. You can't be moving your controller or the joystick like close to nothing if you want to walk. Any treasures back here? There is. And the dot times two. Let's actually go quickly through the items we have. And it occurs poison. There's also things that cure like darkness and silence and stuff like that. I rarely use them. That's just me. Also, I keep going through you know, just sorting the inventory by automatic a lot. Even though I never used them. Nothing here. Right. I guess we're going then. I'm sure this is really emotional. I mean, living in one in a small community for 10 years and then leaving. Goodbye. Right, here's the map. We are said now we are going to Kilikabold. I guess that's uh, kind of a middle stop for us. Oh, come on, Tidus, stop being a jerk. Seriously. Yuna and Kimari? Kimari, right. So many places to go to. Come to think of it, I haven't told you where we're going. First to Kilika Island, then we change boats and head for Luca. For that though, Yuna's gotta pray at the temple. I'll be guarding. We'll be praying for the Aurochs victory too, so you come along, yeah? <sighs> great plan. Hey, it is a great plan. Don't look at me. It is a great plan. What you're talking about, Lulu? Let's just explore a little bit. Maybe there's something hidden goodies here. Which there aren't. Before nightfall, great. Yeah. I haven't actually been on too many ships myself. I only can recall one time being on a, like, a cruise ship. And that's it. 
You wanna use the binoculars? Mm, sure. No. Okay, I get I get the thing. Sorry. Anything here? No. I guess we'll just go and take a trip down here. Look like you got much money either. I've no business with you. Add him anyway. Who do you think you are? Awaka the 23rd. Merchant extraordinaire. Awaka the who? Don't know me? Well, not many do. Not yet. Yeah, Awaka is kind of an interesting thing. Oh, interesting person, I guess. What's over I'm there? I'm at liberty to talk about our plan. Your plan? Restricted area. Our operation depends on this cargo. Okay. Whatever you say. What's over here? It's a good thing to just explore before you move on with the plot. You, you know, you might find stuff like remedy here. Why are you playing Blitzborough if you're getting seasick? No, you're just making care of it. Sure, that works. That's the way out. What's power room? Okay, what's over here? What the? What the heck is that? What the heck is what? What is this place? The power room, like it says on the door. Yeah, but why the big birds? What's so strange about chocobo power? Chocobos? Those are chocobos? What? You've never seen a chocobo? What kind of backwater island did you come from, anyway? Hmm. Miracles and oddities were starting to become daily routine on this trip. Okay, I'm just taking a look, quickly taking a look at how o uh, Owaka. Okay. Let's see, anything interesting? I'll be primer number three! Hooray, this is actually why I came to this power room. Chaka pose! Sure. That works. Anyway, Owaka here. Let's go talk to him. Someday, the name of Walker will be spoken all over Spira. Say, lad, you wouldn't have a bit of gill to lend. You now, here's the thing. If you give him money... Now, the thing is... You can't give him money. However... You don't wanna do that because I mean, the thing you wanna do is you wanna give him 10,000 and one kill at once and the reason is if you give him little bit of money he increases the price of what he's selling so if you give him 100 kill he'll increase it by 100% basically doubles the price and that goes all the way up to 10,000 but if you give him more than 10,000, he'll lower the prices by 30%. So, don't lend anything. Should have expected as much. Yeah. Have you got some? No. Uh, it figures. Once I have money and I can find you, I'll lend, give you money because. Once again, if you give him more than 10,000, he'll lower the prices or whatever he's selling, so it's a good deal, you know. Where the hell is Lulu gone? Oh, there. So hard to see people sometimes. I don't know who you are 
or where you came from. And you don't care. If you interfere with Yuna's pilgrimage, we won't take it lightly. Okay. I don't know. Okay, I won't. We'll be praying for the Aurochs victory. Yeah, yeah. Let's ball. Word is that summoner's got noble blood. I heard she's Lord Braska's daughter. You don't say. Lord Braska's daughter? Hmm. Really? Lord Braska's daughter. And Kimari still says nothing. So, is Yuna's father famous or something? She's the daughter of High Summoner Braska. You saw his statue at the temple. Lord Braska defeated Sin ten years ago. Yuna's the heir to a great legacy. It's tough <sighs> when your father's famous. Huh? Walker's a bit lacking in the imagination department. Huh? <laughs> Thanks, Lulu. I'll keep that in mind. And now you're gonna go through some practicing again. Okay. Yeah. Lord Braska's daughter? She just might have a chance. We'll get her to Kilika, we will. She does have a name, you know. Yuna. Hmm, Lady Yuna. Well then, we pray for Lady Yuna's safe passage. Great. Let's just go talk to her. She did say that she wanted to talk to me. I'll talk a little bit more. You're a Blitzball player, aren't you? From Xanarkin, right? Uh, you hear that from Waka? Mm-hmm. Huh. Waka. Waka doesn't believe me at all. Hmm. But I believe you. Huh? I've heard in Xanarkin, there is a great stadium, all lit up, even at night. Huh? Great Blitzball tournaments are held there, and the stands are always full. How do you know that? A man named Jack told me. He was my father's guardian. Wait, what? My father. His name is Jack. You know, our meeting like this must be the blessing of Yevon. Sounds like him, but it can't be him. Why not? My old man, he died. Ten years ago, off the coast of Xanarkin. I'm sorry. He went out to sea for training one day, and never came back. And no one's seen him since then. Why, that's the day that Jekt huh? came to Spira. But, uh... 
It's true, I first met Jekt ten years and three months ago. I remember that was the day my father left. The date fits, doesn't it? The... the... <laughs> yeah, but how would he get here? You're here? Are you not? Oh, now what? Don't tell me. Not again! Will they, will I ever get a break from sin? What do you think you're doing? Stick a harpoon in him and we'll all get dragged under! Sin is going for Kilika! We gotta distract him! Our families are in Kilika! Forgive us, Lady Summoner. Wait! Oh boy! Oh boy, indeed. You know, maybe one day I can have a trip without, you know, sin interfering. Well, at least it's a good speed boost. Let's battle sin right at the beginning of the game, because sure, why not? Sin scale, yeah, these things. If you remember, these are the same sin scales we fought at the beginning of this game. Oh, here's Kimari, by the way. Wings are starting to flicker, can't let that happen. There we go. Yeah, you can keep fighting sin spawns if you want. If you really want. There we go. Regular sword attack can't hit tank assistance, so. These guys, well. Are kind of useless. Walker can hit Sin. So can Lulu. And Yuna. However, it's. It's usually a good idea. Just get. Uh, get out the sin scales out there and just go with one. Also, if now that we have United Battle, we can switch out back for Lulu and start attacking, you know, sin. Also, 2000 damage, yeah. Sure, why not? I mean, this is the you know, to make focus on our pilgrimage anyway, so... 
yeah, we are not really there to defeat him. Also, Kimari can use Lancet, basically sucks enemies. MP and HP to Kimari. Spines! Ow, straight to Lulu as well. That's not good. Right. Blizzard to Sin. Just a slight breeze. That was some nice damage. Now, switch out. Um, I'll get you nine to heal Lulu. There we go. The more magic power Yuna has, the better her heals are. So, so she can heal like 600 HP at the beginning, which is decent enough, I guess. Since she can heal like... Oh, the amount that she can heal is more than the HP we currently have. Keep attacking! No, 84 HP. Not too shabby. Stop attacking Lulu! I know she has only like 300 HP, but still, stop attacking her. I just, just let's get her on him. Lulu, try fire this time. I'll just show the animations for them. Things are starting to flicker. Suck some HP. Okay, how many HP? More than enough. Lulu can finish it off. Wait. Thunder. 77 HP, this should be more than enough to get rid of Sin. Or end this battle. There we go. Oh no, it broke. Yeah, you can start to see how massive Sin actually is. Oh no. Sin got away, didn't it? Yep. The harpoon is gone. You may have seen the Titus is gone. Well... He's underwater and he's dead. Or should be really dead. Just getting spliced by enemies. Walker uses Phoenix down. We're good. Oh no, dolphins are running away from some thing. And this doesn't look too good. So if you struggle with the first boss battle, well here we go, have another one. Now you can attack the boss once again, but let, what I usually do with situations like this, I just get rid of this um, side enemies. Which is a bad idea since they just keep respawning. Okay, let's give ourselves some cheer. Ow. And um, dark attack the enemy. 
Aha, it actually worked. Brilliant, ow. And two more. Train touch. Missed. Do some more cheering. And kill it. By the way, since neither of us has a sensor, we can't actually see how much HP the boss has. Oh, Blender. This is a nasty attack that you don't want to feel. Yikes. Right, we should have good enough cheer. Let's just start attacking. I mean, we've, I've reduced the damage we take from those uh, fishes by, you know, 10. Which is a good thing. Attack again. And blind his ass. Can't actually do that anymore. What guy's out of MP? So that's one attack he missed. Just keep attacking. We'll worry about healing later. Ow. Ow. Oh no, not the blender again. Ow, 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 oh dear. That's not good. But don't worry, we got the overkill. Now if I didn't explain already, overkill pretty much increases the egg AP you get from a enemy by maybe around 50% per enemy. Or maybe it just doubles it, who knows. So if you kill two enemies with overkill and one with normal enemy, you get the upgraded um, AP from those two characters you kill with AP. That is a nice item that we got. An ability sphere is so mad. I want those ability spheres. I ran out of ability spheres. If you don't have ability spheres, that pretty much just stops your leveling up dead. It just stops. Also, that is not as good sight. That is what we are going to go up against. Just a little show of power. What you'll be fighting. Yikes.